guys, Tanisha K, also known as Mary 2KDK, coming to you guys with another planner video. So again, I'm going to be continuing showing you my monthly and weekly spreads for the month of July and just telling you how I use each of my planners. So now I'm going to get into the Faith planners that I own. So this is my Grace Upon Grace. This is the actual Faith Kit planner. That for the month of May, I use this planner as a daily Bible study planner. So I wrote down what I was doing. And then um, since I was ahead of the Bible study, I got to catch up the last week. I did the same thing for the month of June. But I've decided to transform how I use this planner for the month of July. So for the month of July, I am going to be doing a weekly sermons notes in this planner. So yes, I will still put my daily Bible study reading here, but because my Bible studies, most Bible studies nowadays come with a book that you can already write your notes in or they have space in the book that you can write in, I'm not going to um, transfer my notes here. I found that to be quite tedious. So I'm just going to be putting weekly sermon notes in here. So as you see, I have just a little bit of washi tape. I have, I keep it really open because I don't know what the sermons are going to be about. And I don't know what I'm going to add or take away. So I keep it really, really light. I wash it over the dates. I'm going to write the date at the top of the um, page. Like here, the date will go here. Where you saw those big Bibles, it will go there. But just keeping it very light. Keeping it very light. My prayer list will go here. So I really like the way this spray came out. It's so pretty. The, the hint of the copper glitter with the green glitter and then popping off of these flowers i mean this one's so pretty i love i love how this looks so that is what we're going to be doing here and then of course purple my favorite color purple and pink so I, of course i probably throw this in once or twice a month okay guys i turned the light back on i hope that helps i'm i'm trying to play with light. it's a cloudy day so i'm not getting much natural light but next up i have the actual faith planner this is a horizontal planner and so what I decided to do with this one I'm so excited is I'm going to be using this as a daily prayer journal I used to journal every single day and I do now of course I have my gratitude journal but I found that having just a page to write could take a lot of time time I do not have I'd rather be cuddled up with my husband so I love that these are nice short spaces to write in and of course if you haven't seen this I'll put links um, a link to a blog post below where you can get flip throughs of all of these you'll be able to see again the spreads where I'm getting these um, stickers from and all that click below for the blog post link but anyways guys I'm so excited to use this and I was been praying and trying to think like what could I use this for and it just hit me last night when I was um, getting ready to prepare to record this video use this for your daily um, prayer journal except this will be the first thing in the morning but first guys so the first thing in the morning when I'm doing my little um, whatever challenge or whatever reading um, thing that I'm doing for my Bible app I can easily just write down a prayer for the day and I can start my day with prayer. So I'm really excited about that. I don't have anything in the weekly spreads for this planner. There will be nothing in here. I may change it up and add some stickers. I'm still trying to decide what I'm going to do with these boxes. But for right now, for the first couple of weeks, I'm going to just keep it blank. Alright guys, so thank you so much for tuning in to this very, very, very quick video showing you the flip throughs in my faith planners. Alright, so stay tuned. I'll be doing flip throughs for my personal as well as my gratitude and fitness uh, planner as well. See you guys in the next video.